Hello, welcome to the uh, yacht defined in the Hock Yachts. And we are now, now in, in uh, a boat in the Stockholm Archipelago. And uh, this is what it looks like here. We have the uh, same as the, the demo rig you, you may have seen. You have the uh, steering wheel and you have a joystick and uh, tablet. And uh, the, uh, the system is used in the sense that if you are driving, you use the uh, steering wheel buttons and the joystick for uh, most of the features. And if you are in a harbor or if you need more detailed command, you can use the, uh, the tablet, which has touch features. So, uh, for example, you you'd use the tablet if you would do uh, if you want to open the roof hatch, you can use the tablet. Or if you want to change some uh, special light settings, you want to change one of the lights to a bit dimmer or something like that. But while driving, you use the uh, the steering wheel buttons and the joystick. Uh, on the joystick you have, first you have the zoom, then you have all the features such as the uh, from controlling the lights, you have the interceptors, we call it stability, and then you have the searchlight on this boat, and you have a radar and you have another menu. Uh, and then on the, on the steering wheel you have the horn, it works. <laughs> you have the volume for your stereo, you have stability, auto on off, you have the night mode for example, here. And you have the nav lights, you have your uh, settings if you want shot, uh, if you want uh, head up or north up. And here's another detail in, in the, uh, the... We are trying to remove all the settings, so... In the chart where you have the... Where you pick between north up and, and head up. When you have head up, you get it to the left. And then automatically you will get uh, the radar overlay on the head up. And uh, the only other settings is north up to get the overview. And uh, then we have windshield wipers and we have uh, autopilot on the steering wheel. And uh, you get different modes depending on what you're doing in the boat. So if you turn on the ignition for example, it detects that, it, that uh, we've started the engine. And it's get all the other information, you get uh, what speed you're doing, the fuel and we remove. I can turn it off again so you can see what it looked like before. So this is the when not r running the boat you get all the battery and fresh water level and everything but when you're running you don't get that you get other things uh, you get your trim levels your uh, your interceptors and also uh, engine alerts here you have low coolant level for example and the, we have a, a warning that we have uh, low engine temperature so right now the engine temperature is only six degrees so it tells you to remind you to keep your speed low while warming up and now we're going for a test drive. Uh, so now we're driving, and this is uh, perfect timing to run the the uh, windshield wipers, apparently. Uh, and then it's perfect timing to do the head-up chart, so you can see the shallow area which is coming up here to the left. You can see that the uh, the uh, head-up chart is uh, more zoomed in than the uh, than the north up, which just gives you the overview. And here we can see the the sweet spots of the so for this this motor this uh, this uh, boat we have a sweet spot in terms of speed in 27 and 38 knots. So those are the optimal speeds when it comes to fuel consumption and stability and comfort. And here you also notice how easy it is to use a touchscreen for driving. To change the uh, scale of the overview shot, you push the joystick while spinning it. Then you just scale the overview shot, so if you see where you want to go over there, you can set it to like that, and you just get a more overview of where you're going. Yeah? Seems to be 
you're working fine. <laughs> See you on the on the test tour. <laughs>